All right, I have three responses. So are you afraid of the ocean? Yes. Why? I'm afraid of fish. I'm afraid I'll drown. I'm afraid of the unknown. What's your name? Linnea Lacey Evasiller and Charlie Blackwell. All right, hey guys. Hey, how's it going? Good. Okay, so I've brought all three of you here today because you each have a fear of the ocean. Is that right? I You're guess so. <laughs> Cool, okay, Linnea, let's start with you. What makes the ocean so frightening? Uh, yes, so, um, okay, uh, so I was at the dock one day with a bunch of my friends and they pressured me to feed this fish and then the fish kind of grabbed my hand and pulled me into the water. But I don't, I don't like talking about it. All right, Eva, would you like to go next? Yeah, sure. Um... I was out with my friends. We were at the beach, and they kept telling me, just come on, come swim, come swim, come out farther and farther. And I just wasn't that sure about it. And <laughs> I don't know, I must have tripped on something. I was under. <laughs> All right, Charlie, your turn. Okay, can you come closer? So unlike these lovely ladies right here, I actually do like swimming a lot. It's a very fun activity. And one day I was at the beach and I swam out a little too far for my own liking and a huge wave just swept me up. And it was almost like a tsunami. It was huge and I'm a very small person myself. So it really just took me out very far. And that uncertainty, you know, feeling something beneath me, but I didn't know what was there. It was a very, very scary feeling for me. Just to, to see all the fish and to feel like there was something beneath me, like a huge monster. It was really, really scary. And something I don't ever want to face again. So, I would like to ask, what do you think would make you get over your fears of the ocean? Nothing. <laughs> Absolutely not. <laughs> no! God, no. Absolutely not. No. No. Hey guys! Hey, hey, how's it going? Good, how do you feel about being at the beach today? It's not great, really but uh, well. yeah. Alright, okay. So, I've brought you all here today because I want to see what'll help you go in the ocean. I think if we all tackle it together, no. we should be fine. I mean, I mean, if you hold hands, speak all of for us. Yourself. Yeah, speak for myself. Yeah, what do you I mean? mean? Only if it's like really clear. Like, so I can see everything in the water. And I, I don't know. It doesn't look that rough today. Like, there's not that many waves. So, I think I'll be okay. I'm not okay to drown or anything. Yeah, and there's a green flag out there, too. So, we should be fine, I think. Do we have to do no, this? No, it's not happening. Uh -huh. You guys got me into this mess. We're doing it whether I drown or not. Come on. You're right. Come on. Just hold hands and get over it. Subjects have presented signs of improved fear management when entering the ocean. With the help of companionship and feeding off of each other's strengths, they are now able to enter the ocean in a more carefree manner. Thank you.